Which of the following pump is used to pump the viscous fluid? Reciprocating pump? No. Centrifugal pump? No. Axial flow pump? No. Answer is screw pump D. The angle of friction is A. The ratio of friction and normal reaction B. The force of friction when the body is in motion? No. C. The angle between the normal reaction and the resultant of normal reaction and limiting friction. C is the answer. The strain energy stored in a body due to suddenly applied load compared to when it is applied gradually is strain energy. Sigma square by E into volume. Sigma equal to load per unit area. 1 by 2 E into P by A square into volume. We know when it is suddenly applied the load increases by 2 times. 1 by 2 E into 2P by A square into volume. So 4 times P by A square into 1 by 2E into volume. So 4 into sigma square by 2E into volume. Answer is 4 times. <coughs> Pessimistic time and optimistic time of completion of an activity are given as 10 days and 4 days respectively. The variance of the activity will be. We know standard deviation. Sigma equal to pessimistic time TP minus TO optimistic time by 6. Here given 10 days TP. Pessimistic time minus optimistic time 4 days by 6. So, standard deviation sigma is 1. So, variance. Variance is sigma square. 1 square equal to 1. Answer is A. The power transmitted by a belt is maximum when the relation between maximum tension and centrifugal tension Tc is T equal to 0.5 Tc, no. T equal to Tc, no. T equal to 2 Tc, no. T equal to 3 Tc. This is the answer. D. In an automatic expansion valve, <coughs> is required to maintain constant, constant pressure in the evaporator. This is the answer. Here I will tell you thermostatic expansion valve also we are using thermostatic expansion valve we are using for to maintain constant degree of superheat constant degree of Super heat in the evaporator and automatic expansion valve we are using to maintain constant pressure in the evaporator. Sometimes this type of question also they will ask what is the purpose of thermodynamics expansion valve so you have to know both. Gear is based mass manufactured by hubbing process. But in hubbing we cannot do internal gears. Shaping we can do with using pinion cutters. Diameter of shaft A is thrice that of diameter shaft B. Power transmitted by shaft A when compared to shaft B will be power. Power P equal to 2 pi nt. P 
पीर डायरेक्टिव पर्सनल टू टर्क टर्क टू साफ्ट फाइव एस सिक्सटीन टाओ एस डी क्यू सो टर्क इज प्रोपर्सनल टू डी क्यू पी ऑल्सो पर्सनल टू डी क्यू पावर ट्रांसमिटेड बाय ए डिवाइडेड बाय पावर ट्रांसमिटेड बाय बी डी ए बाय डी बी क्यू डाय ऑफ साफ्ट ए थ्राइस कैट ऑफ डाय बी ऑल क्यू ट्वेंटी सेवन सो आंसर इज सी द हाइस्ट टेम्परेचर ड्यूरिंग द साइकिल इन वेपर कंप्रेसन रेफ्रिजरेशन सिस्टम ऑकर्स एट रेफ्रिजरेशन साइकिल टी एस फ्लोटाइल द टी एस वन रू टू कंप्रेसन टू टू थ्री कंडेसेसन थ्री टू फोर एक्सपेस फोर टू वन इभापोरेटर वॉट ही आस्ट हाइस्ट टेम्परेचर ड्यूरिंग द सैकेल दिस इज द पॉइंट टी इज मैक्सीम टू पॉइंट After compression, one to two compression, isentropic compression. The ratio of aluminium and iron oxide in thermite welding is thermite welding. We are using for railway track repairing thermite. It is the powder of. aluminum powder and it is the mixture of aluminum powder and iron oxide so we are taking in the ratio of aluminum 3 to 1 its temperature around 1300 degree celsius it's a fusion welding fusion welding process so answer is D. The maximum efficiency of a machine, a direct is directly proportional to the velocity ratio. No, B should occur when the load is fifty percent of maximum permissible load. No, is given by mechanical advantage divided by velocity ratio. Efficiency equal to n a by v r. Answer is C. Simo chart is used for micro motion story. Okay. In a shaft basis system, the upper deviation of size of shaft is zero. If it is uh, <coughs> excuse whole basis system, then lower deviation of the whole is zero. This question also asked in ISRO. Two times. Yes. Johnson's rule is used for sequencing. Most accurately, centering on lathe can be done by four jacks. 